Hey, welcome back to the Wrestle Vlogs, your place for your wrestling news. This particular vlog will start out with a little bit of a somber note with um, the passing of two WWE icons back in the WWF days. You had George the Animal Steel, he passed away, he was 79. And you had the Russian bear, Ian Koloff, who passed away, he was 74. And I believe they were both WWF champions back in the day. Um, I wish their families well in their time of grief and uh, praying for them to have the strength to get through everything they have to as they say goodbye to their loved ones. This video is not intended to be very long, but I am going to give you a little bit of good news um, to temper the um, sadder news at the top of it. And I'm going to give you the updated card for the WWE Fastlane event coming up on March 5th. Of course, you have Carl Anderson and Luke Gallows. They'll be fighting Enzo and Cass for the Raw Tag Team titles. It'd be great to see Enzo and Cass win the titles. That would be kind of awesome um, to see them as tag champions. I've been wanting to see them as tag champions for a while now. But then again, Carl Anderson, Luke Gallows, they've been doing really good. They've been, you know, really over. And, hell, it could be their time to shine, or they could hold on to them for a while, or maybe Enzo and Cass can get a chance to hold the title. The titles, that'd be great. Um, it'd be kind of, it'd be hilarious to see what, what they could do, what they would do with Enzo and Cass if they had the titles. Enzo would be off the rails, I'm sure. And then that brings me to the Bailey versus Charlotte match for the Raw Women's title. Now, sadly, we know what the WWE has been doing lately. Every time somebody wins the title, um, the women's title from Charlotte at um, a Raw event, they always take it back from the person who won it and give it back to Charlotte at the pay-per-view. So, sadly, this is probably going to mean Charlotte gets the damn title back, and then Bailey will probably win it back on Monday, the day after, uh, and then lose it again at WrestleMania. My hope is, though, is if Bailey does lose it at Fastlane, that she'll gain it back at WrestleMania and have an awesome WrestleMania moment for her and you know and her fans. Um, I think it'd be great for Bailey to get it up, you know, re regain the title and maybe hold it after WrestleMania at least into SummerSlam. Um, who knows what could happen between now and then? But I hope Bailey retains it. And then of course the match that ended up um, kind of killing the um, Kevin Owens. And Chris Jericho love affair. The Goldberg versus Kevin Owens match for the WWE Universal title. Now we all know that this this match was taken by Chris Jericho for Kevin Owens, and it kind of led to their breakup a few about a week ago um, at the friends the friendship celebration or festival, I guess it was. Uh, I hope Goldberg wins. I really think that would be awesome. But at the same time, you know, he's got this thing going on with Brock Lesnar. Who knows what could happen with that. I don't know if they want that to be a title match or not. If they're, if they're not going to involve Finn Balor in the title match, then I think it'd be great for, um, you know, by WrestleMania, you know, with, with, with Kevin Owens. Then maybe we should have Goldberg win the title here. And at WrestleMania, um, him and Brock Lesnar could go for the W the WWE Universal title in the you know in one of the main event matches of the WrestleMania 33 pay-per-view. That takes us to our next match, of course, is the um, Neville versus Jack Gallagher Gallagher match um, for the WWE Cruiserweight title. I've got a feeling that it'll be a great match. It'll be uh, uh, Gallagher is great, Neville's great. It'll be an awesome match, but I'm pretty sure Neville will end up winning that. But as we get closer to the pay-per-view, I'll give you my um, rundown of who I think will win, who will lose, and one more updated uh, list of matches if it changes. And that brings me to the last match that I'll mention that I have on the card for right now um, that, have been, that has been um, reported by the WWE and mentioned on television. And that's Roman Reigns versus Braun Strowman. And I think that'll be an awesome match um, between those two. I'm pretty sure Braun Strowman's going to have to get the win there. It'd be just killer for them to, you know, just killer for his momentum for him to lose to Roman Reigns. I have no problems with Roman Reigns. I think Roman Reigns is a great wrestler, but they've got so much built up in Braun Strowman. I think it's just time for him to just destroy everything, you know, all the main people on the roster. Unfortunately, 
WWE is a little short-sighted sometimes, so who knows what will happen. But this has been another edition of the Wrestle Vlogs. I hope you come back every Tuesday and Thursday for more. Don't forget to subscribe, slap the like button. Twitter and Facebook links will be in the description. Have a nice day.